Europe specializes in erasing history. They wiggle away from accountability all the time, whether it's colonial reparations or racism. This dodginess extends to climate action as well. They blame India and China for global warming. But what about their own industrialization, their own emissions? Europe prefers to not talk about that. They say things are much better today, that Europe is leading the 21st century climate battle. Turns out, it is just another lie. Let me show you some pictures. These are from Europe's gas plants, some of the biggest on the continent. From outside, everything looks normal. No plumes of smoke, no leaks, everything seems to be in order. Now we're going to swap cameras. We are going from normal to infrared. Do you see the difference? Do you notice the steady stream leaking from the pipes? This is methane, the second biggest cause of global warming. You can't see it with your naked eyes because methane is colorless. But these infrared cameras can catch it. A climate watchdog went around Europe with these cameras. They inspected more than 200 plants. Guess what they found? Methane was leaking at 123 oil and gas sites. They're all over Europe. In Austria, Germany, Italy, Hungary, Poland. Some of the self-proclaimed champions of Earth. Why is there no action against these gas plants? Because technically, there is nothing illegal about it. The European Union does not have laws curbing emission of methane. So these companies are not breaking any law. They're going by the book. It's a classic case of governments ignoring outdated laws because these leaks are completely preventable. Let me tell you how with a crash course on methane. It reaches our atmosphere in two ways, through leaking and venting. Leaks are pretty self-explanatory, but venting is slightly more complicated. When crude oil and coal are extracted, a few unwanted gases are produced. Methane is one of them. What do companies do with these gases? They release them into the atmosphere. That's called venting. Scientists say this is avoidable. Existing technology can be used to cut down emission at the source. There is a lot of methane coming out. Uh, if it is, this is confirmed, this methane can be uh, recovered and used. I mean, everybody here uses methane. There is an industrial area here using a lot of methane. Why, why we have to put it in the sky? And, uh, and, and contribute to the destruction of our climate. So there must be more uh, rational ways in year 2021 to use methane instead of venting in the atmosphere. Does Europe have this technology? Of course it does. Then why are gas plants still releasing methane? For a block that has laws on bendy bananas and the color of your cheese, this is criminal negligence. The European Union re realizes this. In fact, they are now drawing up new rules on methane leaks and venting. But don't expect quick results. These rules will go through the infamous EU bureaucracy. Leaders will debate, argue and blame each other. And all this time, methane will continue to leak. This is tragic news because methane is the most dangerous during its first 20 years in the atmosphere. Almost 80% more potent than carbon dioxide. So methane is not a long-term threat. Its effects are more immediate than other greenhouse gases. And it's not just leaking in Europe. The entire developed world is guilty of this. In 2019, the New York Times used infrared cameras to capture methane leak leaks in the US. And there were similar pictures from Russia as well. These countries have flooded the atmosphere with greenhouse gases. But it's difficult to pin the blame because in the case of methane, there is literally no smoking gun. You need a camera worth $120,000 to see the leaks. So these countries act innocent and then peddle pictures of smoking factories in India and Brazil. As I said in the beginning, wiggling away from responsibility, the developed world never did stop polluting. They still churn out greenhouse gases, but their biggest trick was convincing the world to play along, to believe that Europe's chapter of pollution is behind them. In that sense, these methane leaks are almost poetic an invisible gas to front a big lie. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.